Range Rover Evoque is not necessarily an old model on the car scene and its design is far from perished but the Brits decided that it could use a small facelift in 2015 and they brought their new car to the Geneva Motor Show for a proper introduction. You'll have to squint really hard to notice the changes done to the body of this crossover but they're there, believe us. Up front, you'll notice the new wire mesh design along with a two-bar front grille and bigger air intakes to the sides, these being basically the only things that changed. Round the back you'll also see a redesigned tailgate spoiler that now has an lead powered cluster working as a brake light. That and the new wheels you can have for your car are basically all the changes from a visual standpoint. On the tech side of things, the new Evoque is actually the first Land Rover to get full LED adaptive lights with integrated daytime running lights that spread from one end to another of the headlights. There are also two new diesel engines on the table, part of the Ingenium lineup. They are basically upgrades of the already available plants that have various improvements in key areas. The 2.2 liter TD4 diesel makes 150 HP and is now made of aluminum entirely, shedding around 20 to 30 kilos in the process. According to Land Rover, it's also a class leader in CO2 emissions with 109 grams per kilometer. The second new plant has 180 HP and uses the same architecture. Unlike the 150 HP mill that can return up to 68 mpg UK, 4.2 L 100 km, the more powerful alternative will do up to 59 mpg, 4.8 L 100 km. Adopting Ingenium technology means that owners will now have to service their cars once every 21,000 miles, 33,810 km, instead of 16,000 miles, 25,000 km. Inside the cabin, the changes were also subtle, being limited to the seats and door casings as well as a new infotainment system accessed via an 8-touch screen. Thank you.